Hi everybody, Jeremy here from Video Detail Studio and today I'm going to share with you the new way to install titles, transition and other templates in DaVinci Resolve 17.3 using DRFX file. Let's check it out. Alright, so we're in DaVinci Resolve 17.3 right now, which is at the moment where I record this video, the latest version of DaVinci. Uh, and the way to install title, transition and template has changed a tiny bit. So before you needed to just go and find uh, the template folder in your directory, doesn't matter if you're on Mac or you're on Windows, you just go on the Fusion page and then show folder. And here you just go over to template and here right there you should have the edit and the fusion folder and you basically install your title uh, over here but it's not the case anymore now you use drfx file um, you will not have the edit and the fusion folder at all uh, you can still create them and uh, you can create all those directions and install old version uh, of presets that you've done um, but now moving forward the new way will be to use a drfx file if you want to see a tutorial on how to create a drfx file uh, please let me know and i'll make a video about that but for the time being i'm just going to show you how to install them now and it's actually a game changer uh, for me that create assets for you because it's so much easier to do and i'm currently in the process of converting basically all the title pack to the drfx format so it's easier for you to install and it's uh, compatible with the future version of davinci resolve 17. and to show you the installation process i'm going to use the new startup pack that we created you can download it uh, by following the link in the description it basically compile um, a bunch of assets that we've created so far uh, uh, it's about 20 titles and we hope it's going to help you uh, editing. So you can just, once you download it, unzip it and then it just gives you a folder. And in that folder, you have basically two things that are uh, important. You have the fonts. So if your uh, assets come with fonts, uh, make sure to install all those fonts by double click on them. And then you have the new DRFX uh, file. And you just need to have DaVinci Resolve basically open right here and you can do it in two way you can either right here drag and drop it directly into fusion and here will just pop up a window where you can directly install it or you can also simply if i cancel right here i can simply double click on it and it will do the exact same thing and open a window directly here in davinci and here if i click install the process should work and you and everything is installed so as you can see it's just like a life changer uh it make it so much easier to install anything directly in davinci um, and here if we look for the starter pack as you can see also we've added some thumbnail to it that's also a new thing in davinci resolve 17.3 so here you can have a very very small preview uh, next to your title to see what you're looking for the cool thing is that they're gonna automatically being placed either in the title generator or effect uh, depending on the kind of asset that it is and you have also access to it directly here in fusion um, you can do both edit right here and look for the right asset uh, here in edit with the starter pack for example right here but also here in fusion there is uh we've created like a folder direction where you can just click directly on the starter pack right here and you have also all those elements and you can just drag and drop them uh directly from the fusion page uh and they're organized within one folder again if you have old titles you can still install them by just simply clicking here on template show folder and you just go to the template folder and here you create the directory yourself. So here you create the edit folder and the fusion folder. And here in edit, you will create effects, generator, titles and transition and um, paste your uh, dot setting file right here in the dedicated folder. But as mentioned again, Moving forward, at least for us, everything gonna be DRFX now. I'm gonna follow that new way of installing assets in DaVinci Resolve 17. I hope this video was helpful. Let me know in the comment if you have any question. I'll be very happy to try to provide an answer. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next one. Bye. Improve your video and speed up your workflow by using easy to use drag and drop templates made specifically for DaVinci Resolve. Check it out on our website, videoeditorstudio.com.